You say, you're supposed to be an incredible ladies' man, and yet you wear glasses. <laughs> yeah, we have to stay up late at night to do that, you know that. <laughs> you get short-sighted. Well, uh, uh, no, but I mean, can you imagine in the movies uh, 15 or 20 years ago, a, a leading man who wore glasses and, and was considered a handsome um, sex symbol of the, of the screen, as you are? Yeah, I, I, but no, I, I, I wear glasses, but um, I'm, I'm certainly not handsome. And I don't really think I'm considered a sex symbol anyway. I don't, I don't, I don't think a lot of women go to see me in movies. Oh, you are it's by the girls on my staff. Know, really? Yes. It's never noticeable. I came through there, nobody looked at me. <laughs> you were looking too high. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So you were looking at this level. The girls were the ones no, who were walking over and every, passed out as you came in. No, they, no, it was everybody was sitting around very calm. Well, I read your Playboy interview and, and you were just the ladies' man of all time in that. Yeah, well, it's a place to be the ladies' man in Playboy, isn't it? I guess so. That's a sort no, of thing. I'm, I'm not a gentleman's man. Let's put it that way. Uh, I, um, <laughs> Why don't I understand that? <laughs> well, the point is, I is, like is there anybody? Yeah, I'll <laughs> thank I, you, Dick. Yeah, I think you're fine. No, but I mean, the people say to you, "You're a ladies' man." Now, what's the opposite of being that? Uh, either you're married or you go out with guys. I'm not married, I don't like guys, I go out with ladies, and, and that makes me a ladies' man. No, no. Well, you what do you mean, mean is I go out with a lot of them? Lo lots of ladies, yes. No, I don't. Of... The newspapers tell lies. That's what I go out with. I wish I could, go, I I wish was... I could get all the girls they said I've been out with. Yeah. <laughs> but you told them outrageous things. You discussed you, how you lost your innocence, which I can't imagine anyone discussing in public. I, I don't think I've lost my innocence. You know what I mean. I know what you mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But I, don't, I really don't think I've lost it, in a way. Oh, in a way? Yeah. It'd be I interesting to know what that way is. I'm not going to tell you. No, not on the show. You'd lose your sponsors. <laughs> really? Yeah. You mean you figure you have... You. You might get, yeah, you might get others, yeah. depending on... No, but you did. I mean, I can't imagine if I, I get a Playboy interview, but nobody asked me that. Well, they asked me that because I made a movie called Alfie. That's why. Yeah. But, uh, no... It had something uh, to do with a plant or a bush or a garden or something. I don't remember it clear. Several years ago, I was, but... Oh, I know, yeah. Uh, you mean, what do you mean about losing my innocence? Yeah. Something, I, I um, picture bushes or a garden or vegetables or something. Yes, it was in rhododendron bushes, I remember. <laughs> That's it. But there was, I, I tell you why I figured I hadn't, hadn't lost my innocence. Uh, um, it was so long between the first time and the second time <laughs> <laughs> that I thought I'd mislaid it in the first place. <laughs> What, what is the difference between people? Now, why would Playboy ask you a thing like that and, uh, they, well, they, I think and not you, me? Well, because uh, I think you're, you're inhibited when you're on, on a television. Can I ask well, you a question? Well, they interviewed me in Playboy and they didn't... Can I ask yes. you a question? Yeah. How did you lose your innocence? <laughs> you asked me uh, how... Why, why did... Well, first you have to define innocence. Uh, okay. uh, you know what I mean is how you define... <laughs> It was sheer carelessness. Uh, <laughs> is this a proper way for yes, ladies no and gentlemen no. to... Ladies and gentlemen, there aren't any ladies here. Yeah, I was no. wondering about that, too. Yeah, I look around fast. <laughs> no. There aren't any ladies here, which I think is a little significant. I've... Yeah, you've got ladies tomorrow. Yeah, how do you know that? Liza Minnelli, you had it on the card. Oh, yeah, I mentioned that already. Yeah. yeah. Ladies, and you get Gail Sayers, too. Gail Sayers. Gonna, he's going to slap you for that. Gail Sayers. Oh, does he... Do, do, does he have... Do people kid him about his name? Do you I know? don't. Is that a man? Yes. Gail Sayers is a football player. Is a man. Do you know a lot about women? I mean, would you? Can you? you no. They, you, if if you don't know very much, uh, you get very successful. If you know anything, they get suspicious. So you you'd be fried alive for some of the things you said in your Playboy interview by mm -hmm. the women's movement. Can we deal women's with some lid. of that when we come back? Oh yeah, I, know, okay. I was interviewed once by Gloria Steinem before she was liberated. Uh huh. <laughs> 